Some of you would rather see me on the stage with my leg way up over, over a man neck. You'll never see it. The devil is a liar. You know, look back to Black of Water, where me the most wanted from Clarendon. You know, the most wanted long time. But get this blood class straight. Ask every chapel down there. None of them are rich like me. Me a millionaire from seven years ago. I believe you come a Batman father money. I, Ninja Man, did not and would not solicit anyone to cause physical, psychological, or emotional harm or distress to anyone, even when they say the most damaging things about me. Yo, yo, one of these here dance hall, Lincoln Terra Records. One of the talk I turn in dance hall, Lincoln Terra Records. Your entourage, the meat you know it from man, your ruggedness. Minister Marian Hall, alias Lady Saar, clapped back at Mr. Vegas because Mr. Vegas had made some comments about her in regarding to she doing some things that she want to come back to dance hall or things that she had said in the past. Ninja Man make a statement from a lockup because rumors that go around when him and Pretty Dan did have the tit for tat there and people have said Ninja Man send gunman for Pretty Dan and all these things and ninja man refute them claim them so he might make the public know vloggers know everybody say be careful on a statement also there's a viral video go around with his brother from clarendon we might give out some sound warning to our vlogger and also rapper crapper and, and it seems like it depends on the war part and he must send out a serious message bless up bless up and welcome back to antivirus records your new video here Please consider subscribing. Turn on your post notification bell so whenever I make a new upload, you can be the first to be notified. The first thing I'm going to highlight is Lady Saw, which from the other day, it seems like she's always defending herself. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> if it's on my side. The songwriter said, if it had not been, out of the scriptures, if it had not been for the Lord on my side, some of you would have definitely drive me crazy. Some of you would rather see me on the stage with my leg way up over, over a man neck. You'll never see it. The devil is a liar. Listen to some people of God. As I said, the devil don't mess with people who's not bringing any fruit to the kingdom amen somebody he doesn't mess with people who just sit in churches warming the seats warming the bench or just sitting in church just to look good yeah he's why he didn't say nothing when he sent me to the prison why did you say nothing when he sent me to Kernish and back of the market on Kernish and market hmm? but now that God put me on a yacht you're complaining what's wrong with you hey I will not allow the devil to override the plans of God. As a matter of fact, God will not allow the devil to override the plans of God. So I'm still going to ask for the contribution. Yes, we want some money. We want like $10,000 really or more. To just close the book right now. I should just close the book right now. Because the spirit of the Lord is up on me. And God will send me into places that you don't understand. When you hear Mr. Vegas I tell me if you come to dance hall, Vegas can't tell me to come to dance hall. Then the spirit that God tell me already, that man having one foot in and one foot out. And God said, tell him he can't have one foot in and one foot out. So I would not allow him to drag me into dance hall. Lieutenant Stitchy, from I got saved, he was saying, come. You know, and I said, no, God said to cancel all the shows and give back the money. I'm not going. I'm not going. I'm going to wait on God until God tell me. Yeah. So when God started sending me to all them people on the street, I said, okay, I'm, I'm, all right, God, you're going to come with me because it's some dangerous place you're sending me. He said, I got you. Know that God equipped me and is now sending me to, to do them reggae shows. Yeah, I, 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 what, 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 what's the problem? You want the, what, what, what you want? You, you want the glory? You want his glory? It is not yours to have. The other day he told me that he give his glory to no man. Amen, somebody. Yeah? So you try not to compete with God. You can't bring me back into dance hall, you man. You want me to get back into dance hall and, and do what? I will not go among certain behavior unless God say go. Nobody can send me there unless God say. So now that God has equipped me, to go into the minefield 
that some of you not going come out of God business. So when I told you I was going on that yacht, you think it was a joke. Hallelujah. I will not let you ever hear about rolling calf. I will not let Satan rolling calf them block my way. You, when you were growing up, you ever hear about rolling calf? When we were little girls and little boys, you hear the great grandmother and grandfather talk about the rolling calf. People who were butchers, they butcher and kill this and kill that. And then when they die, they become rolling calf. Some always like rolling calf. Standing in God, people, we move out of my way before me run you over with the Holy Ghost. Because you will not stop me from telling you what God has tell, told me to tell you. You will not stop me from praising him. You will not stop me from dressing up. And these are mine. Afi me dem. Afi me dem. Afi me dem. Yeah, I'm my titi dem. Afi me dem. Afi me dem. Yeah, Afi me dem. Yes, I got give me them. Bless body. So I cannot do anything about them. I cover them up. I do everything. It is what I'm velocitous. That's the name. So what a problem you have. I can't do nothing for tight no myself that me can't lift up my hand. Me can't I have to praise him. So I, I cover them sometimes. It go down a little bit. What can I have me them? Yeah. I, a blessed body, it's mine. So cost me for it. I did nothing to it. I have no announcement. I didn't enhance nothing. It is mine. It is mine. Look at look. It's mine. It is mine. So if you have a problem, I kill zero. I'm going to tell you about the blessed body that God has given me. And if you have a problem with your body, your color, your ear, your whatever, I kill zero. I'm not watching you. I am here to preach the word of God. And if I try to dress up and look nice, you no know, complain. If me dress like a woman, no complain. What else must I do? I come in the name of the Lord. So if you have a problem with my blessed body, talk to God about it. Amen. Hallelujah. I could close the book now. Amen. Am I titty them? So what? Take them off? Come on. Some people will want something like this. Leave me alone. Blood of Jesus. I will not let you satanic. Uno so uno. Uno a kian tan uno. So ma uno. Uno come dwell it up in, in, in around God people. And act as if. Yeah? The other day I see Jackie Lynn Carr on a video and all of it was out. Amen, somebody. I took a picture because a man of God, I was on their flyer, did them jingle or uh, whatever to do the concert. And they came back saying, the church people are uh, complaining, getting a lot of backlash. Yeah? Actually, they come for their money. That's what I, 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 I realized. And I took a picture of Sister Jacqueline. Powerful one of that. And I said, I bet if, if it was her you're getting, you wouldn't complain. None of you would come, your people would complain. Your church people and the sponsors would not complain. And sometimes our boobs out. Sometimes it's way up and out. All of them. Yeah, people them wear them shorts and wear them. You understand? Belly skin and things show sometimes, right? And can you believe I said that on the 6th of April? Right then, the day when the person come and has for the, you know, and I said, right, I'm giving back the money. Person says, not really that, but, you know, it's just a few. And I'm just going around. I said, okay, I'll just give you back the money. He said, okay. And by the next day, the secretary was sending message for the money. Nobody don't ban me from the church people. You're running with the thing like that. It's not true. Nobody banned me. The man of God said he was getting backlash because of that black sheer outfit, the bustier that Jesus dressed me up in. Hey, God, thank you. Right? Nobody banned me from anywhere. There were other pastors who I should have preached for even the next week. But because I was moving here, I asked them to have somebody just take that space for me. Amen? So it was not anyone banning me. But when I look, the thing that blew my mind, I didn't know it was a spirit speaking to me because it's actually Minister Jacqueline. She's the one that they bumped me for. She's on the flyer. She's the one in this in my space. I didn't know. My boy, some people said I'm a prophet, test and prophet. I send the message, it's on the phone. The 6th of April, I sent it. What's that? I think so. Yes. And I said to the man of God, I said, man of God, looking, the same picture I sent you of the same lady. 
it's actually her you put in my space. Because <laughs> the lady that came back for the money was saying, we want back the money to give to the person who is replacing you. And, and the man of God, is, he said, is you come off. I said, the man of God said that. Is the man of God come to me with all that and did not say anything else more than, oh, I'm getting backlash. What is, and what? And what? Ah, uh, it blew my mind that it was her there in, in my space. I said, God, you were speaking to me to tell me it's a setup. <laughs> She's a powerhouse, and they don't see me as any powerhouse. So it seemed like a door was open for her, I'm assuming, to come. So they say, okay, we're gonna get this money. All right, take back what Minister Hall have, or Marian have, because they're not coming. Put it with this, put it with this, and you understand? Mm -hmm. God was telling me, and I didn't know. And when I looked back on the phone and I saw the date and the voice notes and everything, and the man of God listened to them, you know. I say, I see them in blue. You listen to them. You see how the spirit don't lie, sir? Oh my God, I didn't know God was telling me. They're bumping you. <laughs> I still can keep solid. Uh-uh. So I want to know what's the difference with these and hers. And hers were more hot on that. Because sometimes girlfriend dress, you know. And we are voluptuous women. We women. So sometimes we have a overflow. Amen? Bless the name of But anyway, mine was, I was just, you know, some shit was on the, the belly. My blessed body. But I love them anyway. And that's still not going to end me. I was hurt. I was very, very hurt. Very hurt. I was hurt. And I I complained to a friend who was a friend of me and the man of God. And I complained. And my manager and I, you know, they come and they pray that they were here. You know, I'm just telling you that I still not going to keep it in. Nothing can stop me from preaching the word. Some of us were meant to, you know, be placed in major places and some of us, our calling is like unto Moses. We love, rate, and respect Lady Star, Marianne, all, same person. But there are times when it's like we don't know which lady star we will get. We don't know which one. Because it's like, to me, she care about every single thing that's been said about her and every single thing in the media. Whereas, she always depends on the defense. But what may I say is, if you work with God, saying, nobody these little things shouldn't matter. You come back to dance hall, you not come back to dance hall. Where Vegas say, it shouldn't matter. We know enough time in talk some things and, 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 but you can't look past that because we're supposed to use to what Vegas has said. But if there's some truth to what he must say, then it will hurt you or bother you. But you're supposed to look past these things right now and I look forward to you. Either you're in or you're out because me say from one long time say, stitch them and do it, send them and do it. So if you want uh, to come perform, you're supposed to can perform and do your good, clean songs and stop worrying about what other people have to say. If uh, because you, you, you realize that uh, your money has gone down and you need to come perform now, or uh, you realize that uh, what it said in the beginning, you ain't really too right, fine, do what you got to do and don't worry about people. Viewers and subscribers, leave your thoughts and your comment in the comment section. Let me know. What uno think? So Ninja Man, I speak to one third person since the um the passing of Merciless and Bounty Kid and Beanie Man never got the funeral. So him forward again now with the little squabble where him and Pretty Dan have and him has set the record straight through the same third person who I make the people them know say 
Ninja Man not in a certain things and Ninja Man no want no, um Ninja Man don't wish no harm um, for anybody at all. I must say when the people want to try come there because you know it's not nice and you know he might do everything through God. So anybody where I say he might end up certain things, it no go so. Before, written and reported by Jojo Mac. By now, it should be known that the source of these letters from Ninja Man is Empress Misha. The words written in these letters are solely Ninja Man's. However, as Ninja Man is not in the position to orate his words, I have been commissioned to present his thoughts to the public. I am Jojo Mac. This is a letter from Ninja Man to his fans, bloggers, and well-wishers. Ninja Man says this, Though I am in jail, when in the public space inside the facility, it's not so hard to know what is happening on the outside because the guards will sometimes alert us about what's going on. Not necessarily for us to give a response, but to keep us in the know to the bloggers. I was once again made aware of the headlines that some bloggers are using to sensationalize their blogs. Some as blatant as Ninja Man sends Gunman. I do understand that topics like that will draw attention to your blogs, but if it's not a question, then it's a statement, and these statements are considerably irresponsible. When you put stuff out there in that manner, it can cause problems for everyone involved. Please use caution when you make the decision to speak about someone in such manner, because there may be consequences. Let me make this clear. I, Ninja Man, did not and would not solicit anyone to cause physical, psychological, or emotional harm or distress to anyone, even when they say the most damaging things about me. Also, please be careful how you use old videos of me in your blogs. I do not have a problem with anyone using my videos, but you cannot use them in such a manner that it becomes a liability to me. Now, to all my fans and well-wishers, Please note that I have great appreciation for you standing up for me against naysayers and those trying to tarnish me in ways that are unacceptable to any human being with even an ounce of decency. When intelligence conquers ignorance, there's absolutely no reason to be retrospective. Please do not use the letter to address anyone as I have made clear my thoughts and do not wish to prolong the situation. I do not want anyone threatened or hurt on my behalf. I would not endorse such behavior. I have made my name on pure talent. I am one of the columns in our industry and nothing will ever change that. And though I find myself in the situation I'm in, I want you all to know that I do not countersign any kind of revengeful behavior. I want you, my fans, to know that I do believe other people may be using this situation to act on how they feel, given that so many people have been offended. I really do not believe you, my fans, are the ones issuing threats to anyone, but people can and will use this situation to cause harm under the guise of being a Ninja Man fan. Please do not use the letter as a discriminatory tool. You, my fans and well-wishers, have always shown me love, and I reciprocated with the same sentiment. Please know that it has not gone unnoticed. Without you being in my corner from the very start, there would not be a ninja man to talk about. You're a big part of the legacy I have created, and though I know some of you would go to the ends of the earth in my defense, I would never want to see you end up in a place like this. Just remember that you have your families to look out for. I want all of you to appreciate the freedom you have and not do anything to give it away. I have learned to leave certain issues in the hands of the Almighty. He has brought me through many things and he has not stopped working on me. My intention going forward is to inspire and motivate. Sometimes you're put in a certain situation because there is work to do that you would not have otherwise gotten the opportunity to do. The Almighty has a way of slowing us down sometimes so we can use some of the other talents that we ignored. Don't get me wrong. I have always tried to inspire, motivate, and help others as a free man. But sometimes we are placed in a position where all we can do is what God requires of us in its entirety. Don't fight a physical battle for me. Fight a spiritual one. Keep praying for me that God will one day see this as mission accomplished and I will get to see you again in person, doing all the things you love me for. Remember this, when life gives you lemons, don't just make lemonade. Make a cake to go with it. As I close out this letter, bear in mind that love conquers hate and that will never change. Love and protect each other and help to make the world a better place. Thanks to all of you. Until next time. Now you move on.
to a viral video we see a go around with one brethren. He pretty peed off and he must say some things and he must say what really, you know, like chipping head is because from a money freeze, you know, him, him wife passed away and it's like, him not getting a loyalty from him friend then. The man attack some things. The man attack about rapper crapper. So him send him things to rapper crapper. A rapper crapper and post it. Him also attack about Serpy. Him say, yo. You know, him say like, enough bad man respect Serpy because Serpy always get it right. So, one next vlogger, you know. I said some things about him. And him make some threat to uh, the vlogger. And things of that nature. And the man of him things with him uh, expose him pie pie. Charge it. I have the money, yeah? All I'm Batman friend, I'm Batman family, you hear me I tell you? Yo, the piece of blood clot that the vehicle come up on the ground, yeah? Steam fish, yeah? No ram put me down on that blood clot, yeah? I'm coming, yeah? No ram put me in a batty boy. Because the mother answer the phone, me I call in a batty boy. A straight foot, me I pull up in them phone. No ram put me in a... My wife dead, yeah? I'm here alone. Oh. You know, the body blog of water about me and the most wanted from Clarendon. You know, the most wanted long time. But get this blood class straight. Ask every chapel down there. None of them have a shot me. Me a millionaire from seven years ago. I mean, you become a body man for the money. I mean, no man first supposed to super rich on me. Me, where you see here, worth over $1.5 million US. Ask body man speed again and friend them. And every one of them. None of them in the league. I was a was never sleeping now. Mother, I have 50 million million dollars I spend for speed of God and the one of my kids as them from 2000 Bamba Club 17 to 2022. No more dead and God left me. I see I love me and my mother now. And my friend them, my teacher, my game. I kill for them, rough for them, turn them into some money. And now, I come and I tell the bossy boys I don't care how money come. Kawa. I was dead on my money free. But you know what I'm telling you, my business. I don't know my money free, but I'm telling you. Why don't you know? Because I don't know my company income here, a million dollars. Bossy boy. And me, I had a blood clot, man. I walk with that three, four, five million dollars back. And I get dirty stinking junk. Don't blood clot for me, no big bossy vlogger boy. Any of my nose vlogger said I'm going to kill him now. No. Tell me your name, vlogger boy. If you don't blood clot, Sir P don't talk about me. Because Sir P always get him fucks blood clot right. That's not every real murder respect Sir P. Hey, I'm not a bum buckler, fuck. Hey, don't let me show you what my face is a pussy. You know what I'm telling you? Me don't want a weak blood clot, vlogger boy. Go talk about me now. We don't look a small fuck now. Ask the police about me up in the p. Ask them. I want more can feed police. I tell me tell you spend my money now. I'm going to work my phone. Cause I get paranoid, I'm soon dead. Somebody left my money now and stop spending. Cause I'm going to tell you if you give me two down to them. So bossy boys. Come and count the money come give me. I only remember my chief AK dog. Cause I'm missing my link speed and him bossy man friend them now. And he must spend money to man J cool them on him now. I ain't gonna introduce me to them and I'm here dead now, bossy boy. You know I'm in the speed, huh? To all my bigger youth. And I look a full food boy. When you make money, I say, yo, buy a car, bossy boy. You ain't never much car with him. I say, pussy buy a gun. Before man, box of your ears. Vlogger boy, you have talk about. Me a chat chat. Why you think they can't answer? Call me hell of two. And if you're not from anything them, them know me a murderer youth. Ask me ugly man and father about me, for me a pity me a kill. Me kill more than 100 people. Police are nothing to me. Yes, they can't find me, they can't touch me. Last time, I got me out of bed. And video call the police and say, pussy. Read me before me done bed. Alright, since I see a gun, I kill 10 police. I see AK me by, brother. Bulletproof vest. Me have 300 rounds for each gun. But some of the bossy brother boy. I'm there, sir. You see a big pussy rapper crapper. Bats the boys call and we see them things them pussy. And they have a post them junk. Hey, let me tell you this blood clot now. I mean them killing them bum buckler kill. All night me and I come to gym. Many like young Sam. One. Four F. Go watch you one boy. And stop fucking go watch you one. Learn that. 
The laughing people. Listen. Ask the police and why they might look for me. Two of my friends chase me out. I go up on my yard. Go chop up my auntie. Chop up my husband. And chop up my son. Me alone. I'm in a check cook. I'm in a check pill. All you see me do a bun cigarette and drink water. So I'm in a jugs. Just don't want to tell me. Hey, let me tell you that straight. Tonight, I'm going to kill three man. In a, hey, don't run put me in a butt, brother. I never want to kill out already, I don't know, you know. Hey, let me tell you straight. It's just that I don't want to put blood clot, man. Any vehicle. Walk with 20 guns, I'll kill you, know. Shoot up a vehicle and check them out. No little chip black can ramp with me. Chip black can fuck with me. He won't have a gun in my full iron. You know what is an AK Batty boy? AK flick. And tear up your blood clot, BMW, and tear up your ass. And that's the boy. Tell the police them. Say when they come from me, see? Bring soldier when they can't manage me. When you look at 16 light, yes, you don't know, come from what you want me to do. I disappear, no one has to see my turn. I just me two killers, you know, see. I'm a two killers disappear. I just need to eat that one in the world. Both in a kill family. Now, if I'm a killer, I'm a bastard boy, I'm say, yo, kill me, auntie, for me. And kill me, cousin. And kill the bastard boy, and fuck me, auntie. Boy, come tell me, say, him not kill the bomb buckle of family, and the fiend family. That means he never kill nobody. Can anybody can have a piece of my family? Where is you with my father? I pull out my gun and take out my blood clot and start chopping them. I kill the husband and sleep you now. When my auntie flies, I'm holding my chop in my million times you now. I'm a proud of blood clot. I'm a bit of Robin, my uncle. The reason I'm a uncle and say, I'm not kill her tonight, I become a special way of killing a blood clot. I'm going to tell you, oh, I'm a killer. And I'm going to have my next. We over here don't endorse anything in our violence, but my brother here seems like he might go on our way. Let me know what I think about what he's saying and all those things. Leave your like, leave your thoughts, leave your comment in the comment section so we can talk about it. We've come to the end of another video. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel, those who have learned to us yet. Also, please turn on your post notification bell so whenever I make a new upload, you can be the first to be notified. Peace out, bless up. I'll definitely catch you in the next one.